My name is Orton Purser and I'm a doctor of marine ecology and I work in the Deep Seas Group here in Arvi where I look after the robotic equipment we use to do imaging and mapping of the deep sea seafloor. For me personally, getting this science prize is going to be really useful when I apply for more money and more projects to do the same sort of research. This research shows how we can integrate all of the research topics in RV together nicely. We had ocean chemistry, we had uh, surface biology, all involved in my study of the seafloor where we describe these fish nest community. So we can really try and approach the question of why the fish nests are here in this area, under the ice, from many angles. And on top of that, this piece of work also supports the RV policy aims in establishing marine protected areas in at-risk locations such as the Weddell Sea, where we focus on here. This is the sort of science I really like to do, and I think this prize will really help us apply for more money to carry on this sort of research in the future. What would I like to do with the prize money? Well, um, I'm spending a lot of my time on the ship, so I can't really spend any money, but when I'm on shore, I like to do long distance cycling around the uh, German, North German area, looking at the Paleolithic sites and remains that we have here. And I've just broken part of my main bike for doing this, so I will use this to repair that. What I love most about my job is getting the chance to explore areas of the ocean that no one has been to before with the equipment that we have here in the Alfred Wegener Institute and to work in collaboration with internal and external partners and technicians which really support the science that we do. I really like the fact that every time I go to sea, I know I'm going to see something no one else has seen before. I'm going to explore something for the first time or with the latest equipment. This is really, really satisfying to do. There's lots of people I would have to thank for this award. First off, my collaborating authors on this paper, but also, of course, the technicians that helped me build this equipment and maintain this equipment, the Polar Stern crew for fantastically deploying it in quite often troubling conditions. I'd love to thank the wider scientific community that we approached when we made the discovery to see if it really was significant and to give us advice on what these fish were and what they might be doing, because it was a learning curve for all of us. We didn't expect to find this, this community there. So I'd like to thank all of these people and definitely my family for letting me go to sea quite as often as I do go to sea.